Here for ESPN UP, we are live at Lake City High School, getting you ready for the second round of the playoffs between the Patriots and the Trojans. As you can see, it is snowing. This is really playoff football weather here. And I think we talked about this a little bit last week. The inclement weather, I think, favors Westwood a little bit. I think the worse the weather, the better it is for uh, for the Patriots. But the lights are on, and it's noontime. So this is like we're in the middle of the UP right now. That's right. It feels like it. And uh, you got to see Lake City a little bit last week in their 13-2 victory over McBain and a little scouting. What did you see last week? You know, uh, I think they present more problems in terms of athletes that can play in space than uh, we saw from Elk Rapids. So I, I think uh, the Patriots' defense really has their work cut out for them because there's some tremendous athletes on this Lake team, and uh, they're going to get them in space, and you're going to see some speed this week like we didn't see last week. That's right, and uh, quarterback can run. He's thrown for th over 1,000 yards. Starting running back's gone for over 1,200 yards, I believe, this season. But the Patriots have done a good job this year of containing the run game. They only allowed 10 yards rushing. The passing maybe might be a little bit of a challenge. We saw a couple of big plays last week. What kind of adjustments do you think Westwood needs to make? Well, I think for the second week, you're going to see a team, unlike we saw for most of the year, that's going to try and spread you around and uh, you know try and get their athletes in space. But we had a little bit of time to work on it last week against Elk. You're going to see more of it uh, this week. But I, definitely I would be more concerned about the pass than the run. We just... We just had the ability to stop run all year. I don't see that going away from us here, but it'll be those short little, almost like a West Coast, uh, you know, kind of short passes that they try, and they do it really effectively. I mean, they're 10-0. and They haven't lost a game, and there's a reason behind that. That doesn't just happen by accident, so um, just a real competitive team. Well, that's right, and uh, it'll be a great game. You don't want to miss it. Pre-game starts at 12.30 on ESPN-UP. You can download the free app, listen there. It is snowing, so you might want to listen from your car instead of from the stand. So, Dave Bowes, I'm Blake Froling. Thanks so much for joining us.